Oh, right, YouTubers. Welcome back to War Thunder Ground Forces with the Angry Nerd. And today, I thought we would take a look at the German Versals Flakwagen, or the VFW Flak 41. Now, I would like to give you an in-depth history on this vehicle, but I can't. The only information that I was able to find was from the War Thunder site itself. So, here we go. The VFW was an experimental German heavy SPAAG developed and tested in the later stages of World War II. The VFW was the first of several projects of the Krupp company to mount a heavy anti-air gun on a mobile armored chassis. This initially developed version, which mounts the 88mm Flak 41 cannon on a heavily modified Panzer IV chassis was created in 1944, but was eventually abandoned. Now in real life, this was a SPAA, but here in War Thunder, it's classified as a tank destroyer, and it can be earned with a lot of gameplay and a little bit of luck in the Battlefield Engineer event that's running from April 11th, 2019 to April 22nd, 2019. Now, in War Thunder Arcade, the VFW is a rank 3 premium tank destroyer with a battle rating of 5.7. It has a 630 horsepower engine propelling the 26 ton vehicle to a top speed of 40 miles per hour. It comes equipped with the 88mm Flak 41 as the main gun. Now I have it assigned to an expert crew with a crew level of 150, which gives me a reload of 7.8 seconds with the side skirts up or 5.2 seconds with the side skirts down with a premium account it has an xp reward of 516 percent and a silver line reward of 150 percent so what do i think of the vfw here in war thunder is it worth grinding for and I would say, if you like the Flak bus, then you would like this. That yes, it is worth grinding for, if you can get it. Some people have gotten it pretty easily. I, on the other hand, had to ask Gaijin for a 48 hour rental because it didn't look like I was going to get it. And I don't consider myself a horrible player. Um, I'm just waiting on the rudder. I haven't been able to get, I've got everything else on my first plane but the rudder and I don't know if I'm ever gonna get a rudder and I wanted to get this video out uh, while the vehicle was still relevant and people were still interested in it so I asked them for a 48 hour rental and they were kind enough to loan it to me now during my gameplay over that 48 hours I have determined that this vehicle is map dependent on how successful you might be with this particular vehicle if you get in an urban map and you've selected side skirts down ahead of time you may find it hard to maneuver um, if you've selected side skirts up and you're in a wide open map and want to be able to traverse well then you're out of luck because you have to make that selection of side skirts up or side skirts down from the vehicle modification tab you select it in there, up or down, and you can't change them actually during the game. Now, that being said, why don't we take a look at one of the better games that I've had in the VFW. Here we go. All right, we picked up Normandy. Maybe we'll have some good sight lines. I can put this 88 millimeter to good use. We're on the western side of the map. And actually the cap point, just the one cap point and the spawn point is a little bit more south than usual. So yeah, let's move up this way. See if I can find a good sniping position. I've got the side skirts 
I guess it's the platform, really. Um, this is probably the configuration that it would be um, deployed in, so the guys have room to move around the gun. So I guess it would be more platform up, not side skirts, but we'll call them side skirts for now. And a house right up here. See if I can use this as a firing point. Oh, let's see. What is that? Can't really get a bead on it. It's an M2. Let's take a look. This side of the house. Got nothing here. I need to move. Hills are blocking my sight lines. Try to get a little bit higher right over here, but not actually sit on top of a hill. Not the greatest gun depression on this thing either. KV-1. Oh, nice. M4A-1. I tried to back up and drop the shot, but it didn't work. There we go. Look at this 88 just cutting through them, man. Pain. KV-1, oh. I'm out of targets. Let's move a little bit. Come over here behind this house and maybe take out a bombing run and we hide here. Hold on. Yep. Parker right here. Actually my side skirt is in the house a little bit right there. <laughs> All right. We got three bombs. Don't see any enemy aircraft coming after me. I'm looking for some vehicles that are grouped together. There's a road right down here. Let's see what we can do here. One for you. You, you, right there. All right, let's J out. It's one. Ooh, my goodness, four. All right, we got somebody right over here on the mini map. Well, they just disappeared. Oh, they're back fighting with a friendly over here so I'm gonna come over here and try to help while he's occupied with this other tank oh there he is boom man that felt bad like kicking puppies or something little bitty ASU 57 I just trounced it with an 88. It didn't feel that bad to tell you the truth. It felt pretty good. Let's see. Peek out around this Dicker Max right here. 
Oh, that was a lucky shot. Oh, there's an M24 over here. Trying to sneak up on me. I don't have a shot on him. Hopefully my ally will be able to take him out. I'm going to work on these vehicles. M10. Got him. Man, this thing hurts. Oh, man. Panther. Got his engine. There we go. Got him. Oh, it's just a beating. Oh, somebody hit me in the track. Tiger hit me. Missed him. We had a better reload. Got him. T3457. I missed him. Ah, dang it. Missed him again. The M20. All right, the M24 is dead. The Digger Max. Got him stopped. Let's go a little bit toward the back. Got him. BFW. Got him. Oh, this game's about over. It is. Pick a fork in it. It's done. Not bad. 88 is so nice. Look at there. Let's take a look at these awards. Avenger. Triple Strike. Multi-Strike 4. Triple Strike. Ground Multi-Strike 4. One Shot. Adamant. Tank Rescuer. Sniper. Professional. Shadow Strike Streak. Double Strike. Final Blow. Survivor, Heavy Metal Hero, and The Best Squad. That's not a bad haul. My results, first place in the team, 75,000, 4,500 XP. There's my premium bonus. 16 ground units destroyed, four with a plane. 98% battle activity. Look at that. <laughs> two of those dang crates okay so my final thoughts on the VFW this was a perfect storm kind of game I was able to find a cover and concealed position in which I could use the effective long-range sniping ability of the 88 and still hide behind that building when I thought some people were looking at me so that worked out really well it usually doesn't work out that well I might get four five six uh, kills before I get taken out it's a very large vehicle it's easily seen and uh, you have no armor you do have a good reload with those side skirts down 
Um, so I've mostly been playing it in this configuration. Anyway, if you've liked this look at the VFW, hit that like button. If you didn't, don't. Subscribe if you would. But as always, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Nerd out.